April showers will soon bring May flowers and possibly severe thunderstorms, tornadoes and floods. NCTV 17's Ashley Vroman takes a look at the reasons why the weather has been so extreme and ways to get prepared during Illinois Severe Weather Awareness Week. As the clock struck 10 a.m., employees at the Municipal Center in Naperville rushed to the basement and took cover and they weren't alone. Hundreds of people across the state participated in the annual tornado drill during Illinois Severe Weather Awareness Week, a time for residents to prepare for extreme weather. I would just encourage everybody to make a plan and practice it and then go back and talk to, talk to their friends and neighbors. That way everybody's prepared because severe weather will happen. The Midwest usually experiences conditions like thunder and lightning storms, heavy snowfall, tornadoes, heavy winds and droughts all conditions in which residents' lives could be at risk. Being prepared could make all the difference. All individuals are encouraged to have a disaster supply kit that has enough food, water, medication, and supplies for three to ten days. Smartphones, weather radios, and city sirens can alert anyone of severe weather, which forecasters say they can accurately predict up to a few days in advance. Once we see the storm developing, uh, whether it's with Doppler radar or a report from a trained spotter, then we would issue the warning and that means the severe weather is occurring or imminent in your area you need to get to shelter right now. I would encourage every family to do a drill just like we did here where they take two minutes and they tell their kids hey let's all go to where we go to if there's be a tornado and they practice that. I would also encourage them to do a fire drill to the exact same thing. Set off the smoke detectors and practice what they would do for real. That way the kids know and the parents know and everybody's on the same page. The week-long event is also a chance for the National Weather Service to test their system. It helps us prepare. We haven't issued tornado warnings since uh, probably last summer, so uh, it gives us a chance to, to practice and, and be ready to issue the warnings. It also tests our communication system to make sure that when we issue a warning it's being received at the, the local level by the media and that uh, warning systems like sirens uh, can be activated. Illinois tornado season is from mid-March through June. Reporting from the National Weather Service, I'm Ashley Vroman for Naperville News 17. The city of Naperville conducts outdoor warning siren testing the first Tuesday of every month. If the siren is heard any other time, an emergency is occurring in the community. 